Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I will show you what this dashboard is all about. So you can see some stats right here, total seeds, total clicks, created forms and created elements and some elements that you have created and their stats like seed count and their created date and their target link. I will show you what a seed is and what is an element and you will come to know that what total clicks and created forms are. So first thing you need to do is create a element. An element is a call to action or a CTA. Go to the created CTA section and click new element. This is where you will create your CTA. First thing you need to do is enter a project name. You can enter it whatever you want. Hello world and click next. The second option is to select the type of CTA you want. If you want to put in CTA, you can click right here. And when you click it, you can see the preview of the CTA right here on the left corner. You can select from different profiles like drop light. It will change the look and feel of the CTA. Similarly, you can add brand name to whatever you want and as you can see as I change this brand name this is being updated right here in the CTA on the runtime so if I change something right here it will be automatically updated right here in the CTA and this is the URL of the button or more precisely here you will be entering the affiliate offer that you want to promote getting back to the select type you can also add image form or a video as a CTA for image you just need to upload your image and enter the affiliate link when somebody clicks this image he will be redirected to the link that you pasted right here going back to select type you can also add a form just fill out this information and your form will be up and ready and when somebody subscribes to that you will be able to see the subscribers in the snatch it dashboard getting back to select type you can also add a video as well it's simple as that so let's just create a button CTA and hit submit As you can see we have successfully created CTA now it's time to use some CTA that I've created like this hello world form or a laptop to you inside a new project we will talk about creating a new project or a new seed in the next video thank you for watching this video see you in next video